smiles, there are tears. There's a woman here that is, that is. How you doing? I see tears. Are these happy tears? I'm from the shade room. I'm Justin. How are you guys feeling right now? How do you know? How do you know the family? Um, I'm seven nine years old and they were raised up in my church. Uh -huh. And they do yard work in the father and the son used to be my yard. You you guys have been out here for weeks. How has that been being out here for weeks under tents and ice and snow and rain? Talk to us about that. Better from Brunswick. Thank you so so much. Seventy nine. All right. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is Uncle. Yeah. Hey, this is Ahmad's uncle. I'm on the shade room. So we have about six thousand people watching right now. What is your first name? Garrett. A lot of tears. Um, just a moment of it was it was almost like you could hear a pin drop when we were listening to um, the judge read out these uh, these uh, this verdict. So talk to us about um, about your feelings when you first heard guilty. It's, it's just unbelievable. You know what I'm saying? Because you know we got a corrupt system. We still got a bunch of corrupt police and everything else in the system. So the only thing you want is a guilty verdict. What you gonna get until you get it? You know what I'm saying? And I think judge, uh, this attorney, they were very fair. How has this been for your family? Um, I'm sure there's been a lot of sleepless nights, a lot of family meetings about this. Your life has been, the Aubrey family has been uprooted because of all of this. Maybe start, you guys can maybe start the healing process? Yes, we, a, we can heal in a lot of ways, man, but uh, this is something that you can't never forget about. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because how you got killed. Mm -hmm. Another another thing I wanted to ask, what does this teach our children? How do we teach our, our black children what to do in a situation like this? Of course, um, according to the jurors, your nephew was killed wrongfully. But how, how should children go about um, jogging and, and coexisting with people like that? I would say you need to uh, let your parents know where you are. At all times, you're going to be jogging in the neighborhood. You don't know nothing about it. Let your parents know. Let somebody know. Well, you don't know what's going on with you. All right. And, you know, and that's the same thing me and my brother talk about. Now, we still have to tell us something. You know what I'm saying? Because he did have problems out of people. And that wasn't the first time. You know what I'm saying? Hey guys, this is Justin Carter here signing on from The Shade Room. Um, if you're just joining in, I'm here in Brunswick, Georgia right now, where jurors, 12 jurors, just returned a guilty verdict for the three white men, first accused and charged for killing Ahmad, um, and now they came back with that guilty verdict. So this is the scene right now. I just want to pan around and show you guys what's happening. A lot of family members, a lot of friends out here. Come on, Aubrey! 